okay so we just highlighted one bench and what I did is I grabbed the remaining benches and now I have seven eight and nine layers and what I'm going to do is I will just merge these three layers so grab one grab one layer and then press shift and then right click and then merge so it will be in one layer only and then we will label it bench 2 and then we will decrease again the uh, darkness of this one okay that is fine and then we will now click this uh, LED tube again and then use this uh, pen tool and then let's do the magic thing like stroke pad and then brush and there you go oops let's put our bench to on the top of the led tube there you go again let's go back to led tube and then pen tool okay and then let's continue it here now you can see that all our bench are lighted up very good okay so it looks good and we can adjust the glowing effect later on and now let's go and do it in our sand pit so let's go back to the crop open this one and then let's uh, crop this sand pit areas so i'll choose this uh, lasso tool poly lasso and then i will just crop it okay again don't worry if you cannot grab the arch or the curve perfectly because later on we will adjust it Okay, and then right click and then copy go back to the crop uh, layer again and let's grab this one okay and right click again and copy and then let's merge this sand pit layers so i'll go and Grab this layer 7 and layer 8 and then right click and then merge and then I will label this as sand pit. Okay, and then I'll put it above the LED tube, close the crop and then make sure you are still on the sand pit layer and then control L and then make it a little dark. Yep, that's fine. And then go back to the LED tube. And in this time, we need to make sure that the LED strips will be flowing only on this side and not on the other sides. So we, because I'm sure there is a cover on the other side of the bench on the sand pit. While in the bench one, it's both sides are open. While here, it's closed, I'm sure. So what we're going to do is we will place our LED strip close to the edge of this one. If there's spill light, uh, later on, we will cover this one with the bushes and the trees, which is, of course, coming from this one also. Okay, I'll just show it to you rather than talking about it. Okay, so let's go and press this pen tool again. Right click and then stroke pad. Okay, and then escape, escape. It seems the light is too much on this side, so what I'm going to do is I will crop it using this uh, lasso tool instead. So it will not cover the other side. Right click and then cut. Now it's a separate layer. Look. Okay, and then let's move it. V, arrow up. Okay, I can see some lights here also, so I don't think this is right but that's okay let's go control t just to adjust it and then press uh, control to manipulate it there you go and press escape or enter and then you can see there are still a little spill light on the other side that is the one that i am talking a while ago 
we will cover that one later on okay when we zoom out see this one is perfect okay let's do it now here on the other sand pit and let's use the same layer not this one but this layer so go ahead go here in this layer 7 and i will label this one as led tube 2 and then i will zoom now to the sand pit i'll use again this pen tool right click stroke path there you go skip skip and there you go looking good i think i like those little lights coming out so what i'm going to do i move it let's cut it again and then press v yes yeah i think that is fine and then i will label this one led tube 3 okay so here you go we have led tube 2 led tube 3 and then the led tube on the bench under the bench so that's it we are getting better now we are almost close to our goal and our next topic will be putting a bollard okay so let's go and re review our concept yes so we will use these dots as our bollard and um yeah so okay we're done here sand pit also oh okay so uh, there is a small strip lights on the edge of the sand pit let's go and add that one also so what i'm going to do is i will use this same layer but this time i'm going to make my brush a little thin so go to the brush or b then make this one as one pixel so i'm i'm going to assume that the LED strip will be lower lumen output and um, not so glowing unlike on the, under the bench of the sand pit okay so let's use this pen tool again i don't know if there is a space under or beside this sand pit but if there is then uh, yes we can put our small LED strip either on the under it or if there's a little groove then much better right click and then stroke path see it's much thinner or smaller okay look at that okay if that if it doesn't look good we can remove that one later on all right so on the next topic we will add our lovely bollard see you again on the next lecture